going to show you how to build a chevron pattern. Do you see it on this card? It goes up and down and up and down and up. Chevron is an, uh, one of the most trendy things right now. So there's one. It's done on the top of the card. Here's one that's done on the back of the card, the bottom of the card. And here's one that I just did sideways. It's the exact same pattern, up, down, up, down, up, down, but I just did it on its side and put the sentiment that way. Okay? So let's get going. I'll show you how to do this. You're going to need five strips that are cut two and a half by one inch. Okay? You can do them different sizes and um, you just need to adjust your chevron, um, but this is what I'm using them. They're two and a half by one inch strips. And what you're going to do is you're going to kind of lump them together. You're going to need three and two, and you'll understand why you, you do this in just a moment. For the first three, we're going to take the right-hand corner and bend it over to the left-hand side. So we're just going to bend that over and press. Okay, you want to get them as accurate as you can, okay? And then you're going to turn it around. You're going to go from the right side and, and uh, fold it over to the left side. And you're going to do that with all three of these, okay? So you're going to have three that are bent from the right to the left. Okay, there's one, two, and three. Okay, and for these last two over here, we're going to do just the opposite. We're going to take and we're going to go from the left to the right. So we're going to bend this one over, left to right. We're going to turn it upside down. We're going to bend from left to right. Okay, so here's one and two. Okay, so I have, I have two that are gone, that are from left to right, and you can see the difference here. You can see how these are right to left, and these are left to right, okay? All right, so we have our five patterns. Now you need to um, add them to your card. So what you're going to do, this piece right here is um, five and a quarter by four, and with these three over here that are left to right, these are, um, these are right to left, these are left to right, the ones that are right to left you're going to start with. You see how this folds this way? What you're going to do is you're going to lay this right here on the corner and then you're going to take a left to right and you're going to add it right here. You see? See how one goes right to left? The other one goes left to right? Now we need to take a right to left and add that one. You see how our pattern is building? We're going to take our left to right and then we're going to take our right to left. Okay? You see how our pattern is built? What I do next is I take my, um, my snail, and I just put a little bit in the center just to tack them down until I'm ready to totally glue them together. So I'm just going to take and I'm going to tack each one of these, okay? When I get them perfect, I'll go back and I'll add some more snail to them just to hold them tight, okay? So you're just going to add a little bit more. Here we go, just like this. A little bit like this. This is some of our new paper from the mini catalog. Okay, now you see how this, you see how this um, just doesn't add up real good? So that's why I only temporarily glue them. So now I'm going to go back and I'm going to adjust. So I added that there. I'm going to just adjust this one just a little bit. Okay, so it meets it on the bottom. But all in all, it's pretty good. Now what I would do is I would go back and I would um, reassemble. And I would add this to my crushed curry's cardstock, okay? And then what I would do is I would add that to a base card. This pattern right here is coming from new, a new, um, it's from a new uh, designer series paper packet called Eastern Elegance. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's in the 2013-2014 uh, Stampin' Up! catalog. And it just is absolutely gorgeous. So again, let me just show you my cards. This one is the pattern on the top, okay? This one is the pattern. It could be on the bottom, it could be on the top, but I decided to do this one on its side. And this one is done on the bottom. This is our black and white um, designer series paper. Uh, modern medley, I think it's called. Um, but anyway, it's that simple. It's a fast, easy card, and I hope you enjoyed it. Take care, and let me know if you have any questions. Bye-bye.